But there are two very important lessons you need to know in life. You need to know when you're failing and what to do when that's happening. And you need to understand that you shouldn't worry about the outcome. You should only worry about doing your best at the task you're doing today. Uh, so if you're failing, you have to know when you're failing. It's okay to admit when you're doing that. You also want to know what to do when that happens, right? You want to make a decision, uh, not too many. You want to make probably one decision uh, to change what you're doing or where you're going. And you want to make that based on a plan you've already come up with and the uh, result of that change being a higher uh, likelihood of success. And you do not need to worry about the end goal or, or what happens at the end. Uh, you need to worry about what you're doing today and how hard you're working today to affect the outcome uh, for tomorrow. So know when you're failing and make few decisions to change your course to correct it. And don't worry about the outcome. Only worry about the work you're doing today to reach that outcome. I'm here to tell you once you're working on something that's important to you, uh, you know, the work is not the hard part of the task. Uh, it is the discipline needed to complete the work. Uh, a lot of people want to try and uh, stay motivated and use motivation as, as their key to completing something. And, you know, motivation really doesn't cut it in the long term because uh, you can, you know, not be motivated some days and have less motivation the other. The key is to have the discipline to do the things that you don't want to do every day because you know it'll get you towards your uh, end goal and you'll be a lot more satisfied with yourself uh, if you're able to do that. So discipline over motivation, that's the key to uh, being more successful. Here's one tip I'm gonna give you that will free up a lot more time so you can do things that you really wanna do and that's learning how to say no. Um, you should be very selective on the things you say yes to. Uh, if you say yes to something, then what that is then takes up a lot of your time. Uh, and there are a lot of things that we say yes to because we want to be polite and don't want to be rude that end up being uh, things that we really don't need to do and spend our time on. So if you learn how to say no to a majority of the things that people ask you to do, uh, you will free up a lot more time to spend on doing things that are really important to you and you'll be able to improve yourself a lot more by using your time for what you want to do. So learn to say no. It's not really that big of a deal.